Mr. Moderator, Reverend Klee, brothers and sisters, and friends, and I see some enemies. <laughs> Whether you, are, whether you are a Christian or a Muslim or a nationalist, we all have the same problem. They don't hang you because you're a Baptist. They hang, hang you because you're black. They don't attack me because I'm a Muslim. They attack me because I'm black. They attack all of us for the same reason. All of us catch hell from the same enemy. We're all in the same bag in the same boat. We suffer political oppression, economic exploitation, and social degradation, all of them from the same enemy. The government has failed us. You can't deny that. Any time you live in the 20th century, 1964, and you're walking around here singing, we shall overcome, the government has failed us. This is part of what's wrong with you. You do too much singing. Today it's time to stop singing and start swinging. You can't sing up on freedom, but you can swing up on some freedom. Cassius Clay can sing, but singing didn't help him to become the heavyweight champion of the world. Swinging helped him. So this government has failed us. The government itself has failed us. And the white liberals who have been posing as our friends have failed us. And once we see that all these other sources to which we've turned have failed, we stop turning to them and turn to ourselves. We need a self-help program, a do-it-yourself do philosophy, a do-it-right-now philosophy. Uh, it's already too late philosophy. This is what you and I need to get with. And the only time, the only way we're going to uh, solve our problem is with a self-help program. Before we can get a self-help program started, we have to have a self-help philosophy. Black nationalism is a self-help philosophy. What's so good about it, you can stay right in the church where you are and still take black nationalism as your philosophy. You can stay in any kind of civic organization that you belong to and still take black nationalism as your philosophy. You can be an atheist and still take black nationalism as your philosophy. This is a philosophy that eliminates the necessity for division and argument. Because if you're black, you should be thinking black. And if you're black and you're not thinking black at this late date, well, I'm sorry for you.